people, what's up? I'm back with yours truly, Marvel Future Fight. A whole new video the same day. Now, a lot of you guys have been hitting me up asking me what tier 2 natives to build in 2019 and who not to build. Now, I'll be putting out a new video on that, uh, I think tomorrow. So, wait, wait for it, but... What I'm gonna be talking today is related to the t native tier 2's that I want you, to guy you guys to build. So, let's get into it. Now, uh, this is more about this side of the war boss where we don't have any ultimate modes. But the characters, they aren't too bad at all. Except Apocalypse. Apocalypse used to be good. A one time in the game when he came out uh, when uh, at the age of apocalypse but yeah he's not really in the meta not really in the top 40 or 50 I think maybe in the top 50 not in the top 40 yeah so don't build apocalypse yet unlock him but don't build him unless he gets a uniform and yeah so I put out a video about Pietro how to unlock him you have to do five uh, Clears of every world boss, beginner, oh sorry, normal, and you have to do a certain do Quicksilver stage certain times and stuff like that. You can check out the video. It'll be in the I button on the right corner, upper right corner, and yeah, we unlocked him. We build him up i'll be showcasing quicksilver's world ball world boss ultimate potential in a new video now i'm gonna talk about cable today it took us five days for free to play way to unlock cable we did not use any crystals at all to unlock uh quicksilver now for cable it gets a bit difficult than before the challenges they're a bit difficult than before Let's start from number one, which is down here. So, you need to send a total of 300 assemble points. Now, you can send 500 assemble points per day, I guess. So, this is gonna take you a day. These three missions are gonna take you one day. If your friends list is maxed out, it means you have all 50 friends in your friends list. Not Facebook friends, just normal in-game friends. So, now, you have to clear Quicksilver stage within 15 seconds and within 30 seconds. Good, well enough. So, these six missions, there's no time, one, two, power of co cooperation, one, two, and three. Now, these are going to take you anywhere from one to two days, depending on if you can do it, because... There's no time, number one and number two requires you to have at least three to four uh, ignore dodge strikers. So, yeah. And you can use Captain Marvel and some other characters like Captain America or Sharon Rogers or Th uh, Thor with his endgame or Infinity War uniform or even with the Ragnarok uniform he can do it. You can do you can do it if you have Hulk's uh, Ragnarok uniform, Hulk's Endgame uniform. Pretty much any character, as long as you have, you know, at least three to four uh, ignored art strikers. So that should be easy, because it's only normal uh, world boss and not uh, ultimate. Ultimate is a bit heavy, and Quicksilver does not has his world boss ultimate stage yet. So. Special mission clear times 100. Now you can clear 20 times a day. It'll take you 5 days to pull this. Now combine ISO 8 times 50. Uh, for not so beginner players who have a lot of surplus of ISO 8, 3 stars and 4 stars. This is going to be a piece of cake for you. Uh, so if you don't want to spend all uh, your gold at once. Take it uh, a step at a time. Do it over a course of 5 to 6 days. Because it's gonna take you that much time anyway to complete all the challenges. Okay, so you have two missions regarding combining assets of 
a times 15 and a times 30 now do remember that they both of them are separate so it's gonna be a separate counter for number one and number two be aware of that now you have a custom gear up upgrade mission for three rather should be easy uh, you can have enough of them from you know the special missions and you can do it one at a time you'll have it in another day yeah just do it one at a time remember that now timeline battle participates time 50 now this is gonna take you five days minimum unless you spend crystals but I don't recommend that if you're a free to play player like me and you have to spend you have to be very frugal with the, uh, how you spend your crystals because man earning them is a bitch and spending them is very easy I must say so this is gonna take you five days at least and clear 100 dimensional stages you can do it on a single day you can do it over five days your choice I did it over three days I have my friend open a legendary or a heroic uh, rift every day after the daily reset so I can enjoy that but you can do it with normal rift does not matter the and last but not the least you need to clear quicksilver stage times 70 now this this is gonna take you 12 days if you put all your five entries for the day to quicksilver still gonna take you 12 days and if you unlock it manually i think it takes 250 or 200 crystals per uh, challenge to unlock it so i do not recommend spending any crystals yeah do it the free to play way it might take you longer it, it took me longer because i only did like two entries a day for quicksilver per day and the rest three i used to do world boss ultimate to get my raid level up man it's your choice now let's unlock cables mission there goes nothing now i don't have any entries so i'm not gonna be able to play him right now but i'll show you the gameplay i'll have to wait for the daily reset but it's all right now one more thing i wanted to talk to with you guys was regarding uh what's his name i, I forgot his name guys i forgot his name i totally forgot his name what is his name, man? What is his name? Corvus Glaive, yeah, Corv. Sorry. So regarding Corvus Glaive's uh, challenges for when you have to unlock the tenth world boss ultimate stage, you see the thing is, whenever you're doing world boss ultimate, you have, and when you reach stage ten, you get certain challenges. The challenges are mostly the same but the the character requirements change like you have to build certain characters and do certain stages with them now you don't need to certainly uh, make the characters do damage to the boss you just have to have them on the team yeah so you just need to have the character on the team and it would count as a you know mission complete but for me or for everyone who's going to be doing Corvus Glaive uh, stage 10 uh, or stage 9 I say the challenge for stage 10 is to have Hyperion on your team now having one star Hyperion if you have a one star Hyperion and you have tickets get him up to six stars and get him you know get him on your team you can unlock this but if you don't your only choice would be to spend not 900 because it's 150 per mission so we have three missions regarding Hyperion you have to spend 450 missions sorry 450 crystals to after everything you've done you have still have to spend 450 crystals to unlock Cor Corvus Glaive's 10th mission now I don't know why Marvel did this yeah basically it was to earn money but still for free to play players it's not good man not good at all and I want to rant about it, I want to so much, but 
No one's gonna listen to a guy like me who stays in his chair every day and makes videos. I'm not working for Netmarble. I'm not working at Netmarble. And yeah, if any of you guys from Netmarble are watching this, please, please change this, man. Please. For all the free to play free to play players out there, you don't give us too much. Just change this. Why do we have to spend? Why do we have to waste crystals on a mission like this? I don't know why. Just change this, man. Please change this. I can't stress enough. Change it. Now, we built Cook Solver up. Let me show you. Here is our guy, Cook Solver. I got his gears 20 and man it was a bitch it cost me all of my, around six to seven hundred black antimatter just to get his gears from uh, 15 to 20 six to seven hundred black antimatter and don't even ask me about how much I spent building him up from one star to six stars I think it took me somewhere from 60 to 60 uh, 70 million just to get him up to six stars all his gears to 15 and his mastery up and rolling his ice weight set and shit now i'm gonna change hawk's eye later on and i'm gonna awaken the set but for you for now it's okay i'm gonna show you guys some of his pvp potential as well as pve potential and i'm gonna be rocking with a pve build in pvp now i gave him guard break immunity for pvp and in pvp mostly because for pvp he gets guard broken quite easily and i might buy his uniform sometime in the future yeah the uniform is a must buy and these are his stats i know the crit rate is pitifully low but can't do anything about it he has max attack speed almost and you don't want to give him power of angry hulk first of all because he's a speed type second of all because because he gives himself i think an old speed buff yeah on his leadership so Plus he has one on his tier 2 passive as well. So do not give him power of angry hulk at all. Work on his dodge. He's gonna be a good guy to have dodge, you know, for PvP. And it's a bit hard to proc with him. Yeah. But we'll talk about him later. I wanted to make this video about cable. And we'll make a video about other tier 2 natives and Scarlet Witch. Uh, unlocking Scarlet Witch has the similar challenges, but for every uh, level or every next tier 2 native that you want to unlock, you have to build the previous one to a certain level. Now, for Scarlet Witch, you have to build Cable up to, I think, 5 stars. Yes, you have to build Cable up to 5 stars. You have to do his stage within 30 seconds and 15 seconds normal stage and you have to clear his stage with quicksilver times 15 so yeah it's a bitch i know but what can you do man but if you want to unlock it i have one two three four missions left and it takes 1800 crystals so i think it's 450 a mission yeah it's 450 per mission so you don't want to do that but I think if you don't want to build cable, uh, you can spend 450 crystals for the uh, crystal is for the mission that requires to build cable up to five stars. But you shouldn't do that because you're gonna have to build cable anyway. Uh, if you want to unlock strife and cable's a really good character, get him his uniform. He's gonna be a DPS god for you in PvP. Oh, sorry, not in PvP in PVE. I can say that much plus he'll do abx for you he'll get you a pretty good score of around two to three million if you have him pretty good built up and if you give him a cdp he'll even clear the cap on the blast mail day so yeah man plus you 
want to unlock Scarlet Witch because she's a queen man with the mind control and everything she's a queen now peace out guys I'll see you in the next one be sure to like share and subscribe to my video and bring share this video as much as you can with your friends if you liked it and if you don't like it comment what you did not like I'll try to fix everything as fast as I can peace out yo guys we're back after the daily reset and now I am going to show you the gameplay for cables wall bars normal so let's get right into it shall we now I have a feeling this is gonna be interesting because Cable is one of the guys that I like most from my comics because of his, uh, you know, shebang with Deadpool, even in the movies. Uh, and yeah, it's it's just that there's more shebang with Deadpool with uh, of Cable with in the comics. So yeah, man, I like that. I like the little fights, <laughs> the little romancing, and all that stuff. So yeah, I used f uh, four out of five. Of my world boss clears to you know get my world boss ultimate and so that I could raise my raid level and as you guys can see I'm above 50 it's not so bad for once and you wanna get your raid level up too cuz yeah you want to do higher content you want to get you know booty boxes that are rare or higher so that you have a chance of getting a ctp or a premium comic card which will really accentuate your you know whole roster because the effects apply to your whole roster so you'll be able to do better in pvp and pve now let's get into the gameplay now here i'm gonna be using deadpool or do you want me to use Wolverine? I'm using Deadpool because of the whole fight or you know like bro romancing thing so let's get Deadpool in there and let's throw someone else in there let's throw him in there now I'm just picking up strikers randomly just because uh, there's no need for it and I tried this before and there was some dialogue and I forgot to show it to you guys so sorry about that but it was just about cable killing Quicksilver and not being able to save him and you know in the end there's just gonna be near apocalypse and they're gonna fight apocalypse for when I unlock him so yeah let's see what this is about up there and then the fourth go and he should be dead in 10 seconds man I haven't played no mobile boss for a long time now and I did not know that it would be this easy well we got a buyer for him now I'm gonna be building cable I don't care about the next update that much, man. I mean, I do care about, it, but <clears throat> but still, man. I still have to build cable. I need to get Strive. I need to get Doctor Doom. I need to get Jean Grey to showcase to you guys. So, tell me down in the comments who do you want to see first, Jean Grey, Doctor Doom, or Strife? And I'll build them up first, as per your request. And. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe. And if you like what you saw, I'll hope to see you again today. Bye, guys. Peace out.